And if I took a loss, I'm a boss in my hood Whoa. I'm sounding like I'm lost in the hood Double cross me, I leave you on the cross in the hood I'm good, I got new money What's good, my peoples? Please follow my socials. They are tagged down below. Also in the description box. If you got any questions about these shoes or any other shoes that I review on my channel, you might want to hit me up on one of my platforms, preferably IG. All right, with all that being said, let's get straight into it. All right, this right here is still one of my favorite Travis Scott's right here, Air Jordan 4, University Blue, Black. The first public... Travis Scott for uh first public Travis Scott sneaker, my fault. It released for 225. Can't remember exactly the, the year that it released, but still one of my favorite. Uh, to me, it was it was an easy cop for me. I had cop like four pairs when they released. Uh, that was back when they had the foot apps before it was the flex. Now they just switched up the app again. Um, I didn't read up on it. But I should make a video on that, how they switched it up. Because I think they took all my points away, if I'm not mistaken. The last time I looked at the app, I had no points, which is crazy. Because I had like a couple million. But anyway, that's, I digress. Got the Cactus Jack symbol right there, the jump man on that side. Super nice butter suede on it, as you can see. The motion of the suede is absolutely ridiculous. Um, these did have a, a lot of defects when they did drop. A lot of like glue stains and stuff like that. Cactus Jack on the back of that one. Um, jump in on the back of that one. I think the friends and family that have the Nike and the Cactus Jack. I can't remember if they have both Nike or one of them Cactus Jack and the other one Nike. But um, insole with the splatter paint on the insole. Got the Travis Scott on the back of the tongue. And uh, Air Jordan on the back of that one in blue. So, you know, real dope sneaker would come with the wax laces. No extra laces or nothing like that. But red air unit. Right? The outsole does not glow in the dark. But though, it does look like it glow in the dark. But it don't. And it's just a fire shoe. Oil, like, you know, the oiler color. Blue. Houston oiler. To me, it's just like clean, super clean. I remember you when I had them, right? They weren't even going for much at all. So it was crazy how they shot up in price. And once that happened, the Travis Scott collection just took off. You know what I mean? Never, never looked back. Now, certain shoes he drops that are not Jordan, like the they had the trainers that they don't go for much. He had the um, which is the other one? Hmm. Uh, he got an Air Force One. He got a crazy, a crazy Jordan one. Actually, is not worth a lot. So he got a couple shoes that are not worth a lot. That if you just want a Travis Scott shoe, you can get it. Um, the Jumpman Jack is not a Jordan, or it is a Jordan. But yeah, it is a Jordan, but it's something different. Those are pretty high in resale compared to how much they cost. And um. Yeah, I can't, I can't really, really remember off the top of my head which ones is not going for much. I think it was a Jordan 20. 20 uh, he had a, a Nike, too. Some weird Nike. that that's, that's not going for anything. I forgot the name of that Nike. But, yeah, man, you get my point. A couple of shoes that you can get that are affordable, like the one that had that condom glove on it. It's, you know, Paul is crazy, but that's what it looked like. And then you got shoes like this and Travis Scott Jordan 1s that go for pretty much a good penny. But let me know your favorite Travis Scott sneaker to date. What's your favorite and what's your least favorite Travis Scott? Put it up in the comment section. If you do want to look at other pictures of this, better up close and personal, uh, you know, HD pictures and all that, you can see the details a lot better on the pictures. Go over to my Instagram, subscribe over there or follow me over there. Um, the subscribers is running up on my IG. I do thank y'all for that. And let's see if we can do the same thing for um, YouTube because trying to get back to where I was at that 15K, but only y'all can help me. I can't do it by myself. But you already snow the vibes, man. I love y'all. Thanks for rocking with your boy. 
You feel me? The love is real. You know I love y'all back, man. At the end of the day, rock what you like. Not because it's hype. Stand out and never blend in. Holla at me till next time, you heard? 100.